When we meditate, we're cleaning out the mind. Think of the breath as a broom sweeping through the body. Clears up the tensions in the body. And also cleans up any thoughts that are coming into the mind. Just breathe right through them. You don't need them right now. They've been our companions for a long time, but where do they take us? Well, they take us to some good places and they take us to some bad places. You want to clean things out. It's when you start with a clean slate like this and then let a few thoughts in, then you can see them clearly for what they are. Because if they come in crowds, the bad thoughts can hide behind the good ones. And you hardly see them. And then they take over. So keep the place clean. This is one of the reasons why the forest tradition has such an emphasis on cleaning the place. People talk about him visiting a John Munn in the forest, and even though he was way out in the wilds, the area where he stayed was extremely clean. It was well swept. Everything was in order. Everything was in its place. When you come to a place like that, it, it's refreshing to the mind and also calming. It makes you stop to think, it would be nice to have a clean mind as well. Because we have so many opinions, and we think so many of our opinions are clever. But you've got to step away from them if you're going to see how really useful they are. So clean things out first. And then you can look at what comes in through the clean place and let them see it a lot more easily. And John Fung had a student who complained about how, after she'd been become meditating, it seemed like her mind was even more of a mess than it was before. He said, well, that's simply because you notice what's coming in. It's like keeping your house clean. If you dust the floor every day, every day, even the tiny little bit of dust comes in, you notice it. If you just let the dust accumulate day after day, then new dust comes in, you don't notice it. It's just piled up in what was there before. So clean things out. And you'd be surprised at what you see coming up in the mind. But you'll also be in a position, even though you're surprised, you'll be in a position to do something positive about it. And not just accept it as the way the mind is, or the way your thoughts are, or the way you are. All these things get added together, added together, and it's hard to tease them out. So clean things out first. Make it really quiet inside. And then when the slightest things come in, you'll know.